born for it, crafted by nature to soar at incredible speeds, some of us up to 200 miles per hour, brought up to hunt with perfection, bred to make strong our future generations, built in every inch of our being with power and dynamics. We are birds. Oh, that's my dad, Linux. He's bringing back dinner. Hey, hey, boys. Brought you back a little something. Oh, cool. I'm starving. Good. Eat up. I had to get past that bald eagle family again. Those guys. They're relentless, I swear, Chihiro. They nearly had me. Hey, come on, Sunhill. Let me have some. Claudio, you pig. I believe it, Linux. They've been giving us trouble for some time. We nearly starved over the winter because they kept stealing from us. Why did the bald eagle steal from us, Dad? I'm not sure, son. The family that lives near us must just be trying to look after each other. But you have a family to feed, too! It's just not fair. You know my answer to that. Life's not fair, I know. So, Dad, when do we get to learn to fly? When do we go on our first hunt? When you're old enough, that's when. Your aunt Ebony is coming to visit. Maybe she can help teach you. What are you doing? Quit fidgeting like that. Watch how I do it. You gotta feel the wind in your... No. Just like that. There you go. In your feathers. Stretch them out all the way. Ebony, I don't know how this is gonna help me when I'm actually in the air. Look at you, you got no balance. You can't fly like that. Reposition. Like this? There you go. Finally! Are you ready? Ready for what? Yup. <laughs> <laughs> Spread your wings, Claudio, just like on the branch. I'm trying! The wind is tossing me all over the- <laughs> You have to balance. <laughs> <laughs> Look! I'm doing it! Aha! You rookie! This ain't nothing! Hey! Wait! Don't let yourself hit the water! Like this! <laughs> Not bad for your first time! I thought you were going to teach me! Your dad didn't tell you? I'm a learning on the job type of teacher. Thanks for the heads up! Really! Come on, your dad's gonna want to hear about this. Let's get back to the nest so I can take your sister out next. <laughs> <laughs> I can imagine Claudio's face when you pushed him off that branch. Shut up. Just wait till you get your lesson, son. Be nice now, you hear? Yeah, little girl. Come on. Time to go. Have fun, sis. <laughs> you snooze, you lose. I saw it first, it's mine! No way! I was the one who caught it! I would have caught it easy! If you hadn't gotten in my way, give it! No! It's my kill! Stay back! This is ours! Oh. You shouldn't have trouble deciphering who it belongs to. Let me lay down a law. What I want belongs to me. Ah! Uh, I know you two. You must be Linux's offspring. Oh, look at you two. All grown up and hunting. I guess I should introduce myself to the newcomers then, shouldn't I? I am Phalus. And these are my sons, Osrin, Creon, and Romulus. I must get out here, you lazy runt! I'm here, I'm here! Jeez, why'd you guys have to fly through the frickin' densest part of the woods? Of all places, really? Show some respect when you answer me! Be on time, runt! Get out of here, you two! Before we eat you! Not without our fish! Don't be stupid, sis. Come on, let's go home. Come on! 
go back home ourselves. Romulus, now you care to fish. What? I hope you don't expect me to... Do as I say. <sighs> Fine. Should we tell Mom and Dad what happened? They worry, but we can't lie to them. They find out eventually. You're right. You're back. I was beginning to worry. You took a while. No luck today, kids? Actually, we caught a fish. Bayless took it from us! You ran into the eels? Yes, sir. Did they hurt you? Not really, he just took our fish. And he cut Claudio's leg. That does it! They gone too far this time. I'm sick of this! Linux! Dad! Don't bother you two. You know he has his mindset. Your sister's right. We'll ha just have to wait for him. If he's not back by sundown, we'll go look for him. He's still not back yet. Something's wrong. An eagle! Wait, wait! I, uh, I come in peace! What? I swear, I'm not like them. Let him speak. It's your father. My dad and my brother, they got him good when he came to confront them. Lennox just wanted to talk, but... I didn't want them to do it. I tried to stop them, but I can't fight them. And I can't deal with them anymore. Sick of them bullying you, little guy! No! I'm just as strong as any of them alone. I'm no different because I'm small. They're unjust. I just can't. I understand, but... Is my father... Is he... Not when I left. I think he's still okay. If we can get to him quickly, we might be able to stop them from doing anything. I'll go find him. If the other eagles are there, I, I won't fight them. I'll, I'll just report back. I promise.